Hello, Taurus. It's my lady, and this is my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly express or just weekly weekend reading in the weekend of January 19th, 2023. Make sure all the cards up right. The cards I'm using today are is our is our tarot grand lux. Nope, I guess that's my favorite deck right now. <laughs> Millennium T Tarot by Renata Lichner. I love this deck too. It's making me go somewhere else. But I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, setting up personal readings, commenting, and hitting that notification bell. Wow. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. Okay, so I don't know if this is coming from me. Or I don't know if this is coming from, whoo, y'all. But very, very, very strong feelings of sadness and dread. Like, I feel like my heart is being, wow, I wish, actually, I could probably show y'all my heart rate right now. But my heart rate just skyrocketed. And I feel lots of anxiety. Dang, this thing needs to hurry up. Oh, three. Okay, and I'm just sitting here doing this reading. But it just like, I start feeling a lot of dread, anxiety, sadness. Okay. All right, let's keep going. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. I hope I put that on camera. I don't know if I did. Wow, I think I feel like it's going... I say it's going down, but I feel like it's going up. Wow, I feel like it's going the opposite way, but whatever it is, it's beating like real hard. I think the deep, deep breaths are working. All right, so we got the five of pentacles here. When I flipped it upside down, this is the card that I seen, the five of pentacles. So somebody's putting a lot of time, a lot of effort. Wow, there it is again, that little stroke of anxiety. Um, time, a lot of effort into a situation. And I feel like it's stored, sort of feeling like a waste of time, okay? Wasting time. All right, so we got the ace of wands here. So this makes me feel like somebody does have a new beginning on the way. And I do feel like this new beginning is going to be very fruitful. Okay. I do feel like somebody is very scared of this change, this difference, this new, new thing going on. Okay. Of course, I'm scared of change too, y'all. I get it. I don't like it. All right, so we got the four swords here. So I do feel like there's a lot of thinking about something going on, a lot of worry going on, okay? Mm-hmm. A lot of thinking, a lot of worry. Oh, my little candle went out. I do feel like somebody's trying to get something back, trying to recover something or someone, okay? All right, so we got the Prince of Cups here. So I do feel like some kind of offer is getting ready to come in. Okay. Oh, goodness. Up and down and up and down and up and down. Like, I don't know what it is now, but it feel like it went back up. But I do feel like whatever this is, is causing a lot of anxiety. Yeah, it went back up. A lot of anxiety going on with this situation. Somebody's trying to get something or someone back. Um, I do feel like whatever this is, is coming back. It's definitely coming back, but I feel like something new is coming back as well. Someone new is coming back as well. I feel like some kind of offer is getting ready to come in. Okay. Oh, wow. So we got the Ace of Pentacles here. So, wow, they're going to fill in again. So somebody it just got a whole lot going on right now, up and down and up and down and left and right and good and bad. Um, 
But like I said, change is very emotional. And I do feel like somebody's going through a lot of changes right now. Um, but I do feel like these changes are going to be for the better. Um, but I do feel like with that loss, the things that people are leaving behind, of course, they're definitely going to hurt. And it, I, I don't know if we all experience this, um, but it's like when you leave in high school, uh, middle school, you're leaving middle school to go to high school um, or you leave a high school to join the world. OK, so that feeling of this is the last time I'm going to see or be around or, or be able to love or, you know, do the things that I'm doing today. That feeling like it's, there, there's no feeling like that feeling. Yes, it is. <laughs> the other feeling like that is divorce. I don't know if a lot of us went through that yet, but I know I have. But that's the only feeling that I felt that felt like leaving high school okay leaving high school and joining the world like all these people that i'm around and i'm never going to do this again you know that's the feeling that i keep getting okay but i do feel like of course just like you join the, the world you know there is going to be some sacrifices made but i do feel like for the greater good when it when it comes to this but somebody is about to give up a lot and i'm i'm feeling like this i'm like i'm leaving my family and moving to a different country or a different state or Maybe even a different city energy, okay? Mm-hmm. All right, so we got the Ten of Swords here. Oh, so I do feel like there's a lot of betrayal left there, too. And it's still like I still care. I still care. I still want to fix things. I still want to recover things. Mm. Like, even though... You know, we went through all that crazy stuff. I still want to fix this. Um, but I do feel like somebody is taking off. Like, we could fix it over the phone. But, you know, when it comes to uh, me being there, I'm not going to do that. Not anymore. All right. What the heck? Oh, Ten of Wands. I'm like... Like, these wands look like swords. Wait a minute. <laughs> All right, so with the Ten of Wands, somebody is definitely letting, letting something or somebody go. Somebody's giving up. Somebody's been fighting for something for a long time. And now they're giving up and they're taking another offer, taking a new offer. Okay? I'm giving up and I'm taking this new offer. Um, I do feel like I just been betrayed too many times before. I do feel like I'm going to try to recover some kind of relationship, but I know at the end, the big picture is done. Okay. That big picture is gone. Oh, so definitely something going on with the teens here. So I do feel like when somebody does leave this situation up, oh, that got my heart again. Oh, when somebody does leave this situation, um, I do feel like they're going to be happier a part of this family, but apart from this family, okay? So it's like, I love, still love you, still care about you, but you stay over there, I'm going to stay over here. So I do feel like a good long-distance relationship is going to work out here, but as far as um, me coming out to holidays, it's not happening, okay? That's the energy that I'm feeling here. Um, but 10, 10 weeks, 10 months, 10 years, 10 siblings, okay? Um 10 days could it be 10 decades i don't know no <laughs> all right but definitely something going on with 10 maybe somebody left on the 10th month um but at the end of the day somebody is definitely completing a chapter in their life <sighs> i do feel like a lot of walking away um I do feel like there's a lot of anxiety, but I feel like that's just a sacrifice somebody is making here to um, do what's best for them, okay? But other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.